As an age group swimmer, she is one of the top 20 recruits in the nation right now. Local swimmer Amelie Fackenthal at 17 years old will represent not only the United States, but the dart swim team of Sacramento at this year's Junior World Championships after qualifying in her favorite event. I qualified for Junior Worlds in the 100 freestyle, and that's one of my best events. Even though she's known as a sprinter, Fackenthal doesn't train that way, which makes her very unique. She's not the traditional sprinter, uh, where a traditional sprinter may do a little less volume but high intensity. Uh, Amelie chooses to do some tougher events. Attacking those tougher events like the 200 meter butterfly is something sprinters don't do. But that is one of the key training methods that makes Amelie special. I like freestyle, um, it's my best stroke. And I think it's just because it's the fastest one and I like going fast. And going fast is something she does with the greatest of ease. So when Fackenthal, who was a national top 20 high school recruit, qualified for the junior world team, it was still a shock to the DART coaching staff. For her to make it was a, was a great accomplishment, uh, and it was a surprise, and uh, it showed on her face when she got out of the pool. But that look of gratitude wasn't always there. Like most elite athletes, finding success in their sport can sometimes make it hard to keep loving their sport. I really started like loving what I do probably not even about a year ago. Like I found like who I was and like, like I actually had a future in this, so I really started enjoying every day. Not bad for a Sacramento native whose mom introduced her to the sport the old fashioned way with some parents. I started swimming lessons when I was about four years old and I just like my mom threw me in the pool. I went on a team when I was six years old and I stayed on that team until I was about nine. And she's parlayed that success into earning a spot on the 400 meter freestyle relay team where she'll represent the United States at the Junior World Championships later this month. I don't know what it's like since it's my first international competition, but I'm expecting a lot of support for Team USA, and that's going to be really exciting to feel that.